thing. Because don't nobody want to sing up in this church. I told Bishop Brady. And the only reason why I'm only going to sing a verse, because I'm no singer, is because he said if I didn't sing, I was going to be behind the eight ball. And I told him, don't speak it into existence because I don't have a voice. Uh, Reggie's good seeing you. A flat. Now that's my daughter talking, so y'all don't worry about that. Because she's going to push her daddy. Because I got members here too and friends. B flat. Alright, go back to the F show. Spirit of the Lord is upon me. See, if y'all ain't gonna talk to me, then I ain't singing. That's and the worship. Bible. I'm not behind the eight ball anymore. And the worship is in me. Out of all the things I am, everything I hope to be. the Bible. As long, I just obeyed leadership. That's all. Give me a little more focus here. A little more bottom. Amen. When y'all were doing all that worship, I explained to your bishop that the gift of God that is in me, I want the front row talking to me. And I'll tell y'all why in a minute from an old church and even in my church I don't even let preachers that don't pray sit up front in my church because I bought it and paid for it with my money no building fund out of my own money I give folk in my church who don't praise resignation letters my daughter's here she up your day I have to usher slip them a note and it says please find you a church where you feel better That's why we ain't got no packed church, because I'm putting folk out on a regular basis. Because there's a, there is an assassination plot against preachers. Maybe I should say it like this and see if I get some front row. If not, I'm going to adopt the second row, because really the second row is the original front row. Quarterback is only as protected as his front line. I'm going to say it again. Satan is after big time preachers that have affected the whole world, tearing down their character, etc. And deep saints with no prophetic understanding, we're saying they should have lived holier, they should stop playing with God. But the truth is, the devil broke the front line. You are only as protected as who you have close to you. Now, I ain't scared of nobody. I'm from Brooklyn. I'm a fourth generation pastor. I've seen it all. My great grandmother in Danville just died a few years ago at 106. I've seen it all. But when you have people in the front, that means, because Satan, maybe, maybe, I'm sure y'all know everything about the Bible because of who preach here, but let me just repeat some things. But Satan 
is not uh, lowered to the bar. Satan's is drawn to church. The Bible says in Job 1, that when the sons of God came to present themselves before God, Satan came also. Oh, y'all, he didn't go to the crack house. He made you go there. He going to church looking for his next victim. Yo. And what I hate to say, it ain't personal, is sometimes Satan, because of people not believing, makes it all the way to the pulpit. I told y'all I would talk about 20 minutes before. But if you hang in there with me, you're going to see why we're here. If, well, let me put it like this. My great-grandmother used to live in Wake Forest. My father's from Durham, North Carolina.